Hi guys and welcome to today's tutorial. I am going to teach you how to make a triangle that is perfect for making a crochet banner. Um, I have a pattern up on my blog that will show you how to make a play banner for your child's playroom or for a bedroom or really honestly for anything. But um, these are really easy to make up and so I'm going to show you how to do that really really quick. Let's get started. So first we're going to start by um, creating a slip, slip knot and I am using an eye hook. Um, but if you wanted to make a bigger one you could use um, a bigger hook with a chunky yarn if you want to. It's really up to you but for this tutorial I'm using an eye hook and just a simple cotton uh, yarn. So we're going to begin by chaining three. And then in the very first chain, we are going to do a double crochet. And then we will chain three. And then turn our work. And in the exact same chain, I'm sorry, stitch as our chain, we're going to insert a double crochet and then we will put a double crochet into the next stitch. I don't know why I use cotton for these tutorials. It always gives me trouble on the ends. <laughs> Insert a double crochet there. Oops. So if you look, we've got two double crochet and we have three double crochet now, okay? And we are going to chain three. Turn the work. Insert a double crochet into the same stitch as the chain three. And then double crochet across like so. See, now we have one, two, three, four. We have four double crochet. Chain three again. Turn your work. Double crochet in the same stitch as the chain three. And then do double crochets all the way across. Chain three again. <laughs> this dash of yarn is slowly moving toward me like a yarn monster. <sighs> okay, so as you might could already tell, we're basically adding that increase to create that triangle look by inserting a double crochet into the same stitch as our chain three. And you just keep doing that repetitively until you've got a triangle the size that you need. And it's really that simple. And so when you're done, you, um, Pull it tight and then you use a darning needle and weave in your ends and boom, you're done. Now obviously for my banner, um, my triangle is uh, a lot higher, a lot larger so that I could put letters on it, crochet letters. But you could easily create a pattern where you know, you're doing maybe multiple colors and you've got triangles like this. Um, you know different lots of different things that you could do with this simple little triangle pattern but I just wanted to share this with you because um, if you're needing to creative inspiration this is a great little 
pattern to do and also too if you wanted to do a half double crochet version um, you could easily do that you would just do instead of doing the chain three you would just do chain two and you would just do half double crochets it would give it a little tighter of a look instead of being as loose as the double crochet is but again that is totally totally up to you so yeah super simple uh, if you like this video go ahead and hit like down below and be sure to subscribe you can you can use them oh my you can also um, hit that little bell and get notifications anytime I upload new videos which I am trying very very hard to do but you can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. I am Yarn Tough Needles. You can also favorite my Etsy shop. And every year at the end of the year, I have a big, big sale with all of the things that I make over the course of the year from my blog that was not meant for someone um, that I just have because I don't need stacks and stacks of knitted and crocheted items. So be sure to favorite my shop. And also uh, leave a comment down below if you have other tutorials that you would like me to do or if you don't like this video, feel free to share your thoughts, that's fine. Um, but yeah, go ahead and share this everywhere. Um, I hope that I inspire you to take on a new crochet project and I will see you guys in the next video.